Kia ora, Pacific greetings and talo falava to our English speaking audience. For longer, the Voyage program aims to communicate key information to raise awareness within the Pacific communities and create greater understanding between our communities. The show encourages passion for education, business ventures, celebrating culture and understanding the social and economic issues impacting our communities. This show was made possible by Foundation North, Vuxit and Porridge Civil Engineering, The Voyage Media Limited and Face TV. This show is also available on YouTube, Face TV on demand and at voyagemedia.co.nz. Oleo tūlea sa mō le nei polo kala me na ia fai loa fa mala malama malongo longo puia li iwa yang tau ole no nofo le nei tunu ia fai mata yala ita talai la ta tova ai le au te lenga ai le ole fa pumo mo a mala malama lo uto ma malu le uma le fetu le ni mai o manatu ma mafo fonga le le ma fai ai ta tau fa tino ina tu langa tal fe ngai le le mo le tama ai nga o ta tau tanga ta nu sa mo ia o te aroni. In the studio today we have Manu Samo head coach. Vailuango Matangi, Steve Jackson, and team manager Vailua Aloi Alsana. Manusa Mo head coach Vailuango Matangi, Steve Jackson, is a former New Zealand Maori representative and played for Tasman, Auckland, North Harbour, and Southland, where he was captain. He was also assistant coach at Tasman and Counties Manukau before securing his first head co coaching role at North Harbour, leading them to the Malta 10 Championship win in 2016, which saw them promoted to the Premiership. Also, former Auckland Blues Super Franchise Assistant Coach under Tana Umanga. Team Manager Vailua Aloi Elisana, a Matai of Lalo Malava Savoy, has been the Manu Samoa Team Manager since 2017. Also, Manager of Savoy Samoa 2007 and 2010. Manu Samoa Logistics Manager from 2013 to 2015, currently working alongside Steve Jackson for the Manu Samoa 2019 World Cup campaign. Welcome to our program, uh, Steve, and also uh, uh, Alsan. Thanks very much for having us. Yeah. Kia ora. Yeah, kia ora. Tāro whala. Tāro Yeah, mā so i fui lau lau whiunga. Yeah, fai tāia. Lau whiunga, pa ia i ainga ma le whāli tōru lau whiunga wai lua. Tō mai le matangi oro le nei wai tau le tātou au le tātou tinu. Mā lo so i fua. Yeah, mā lo le wai so i fua. Tātou whai fa mā lo ma Steve Jackson. Greetings, everyone, and uh, it's so good to be here. But just one correction: I don't work alongside. Uh, I work underneath. <laughs> 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 yeah, okay. That's uh, taken, taken that point. Okay. Look, let's start with Vailuanga uh, Matangi, Steve. Uh, why and what purpose made you apply for the Manusa head coach role? Um, yeah, look, I think um, you know, first and foremost, it was an opportunity after I finished at the, the Auckland mm -hmm. Blues. And, um, you know, uh, and for me, um, it's I've always sort of like working with the underdog and with teams that people don't give a chance. And when this role came about, um, you know, it was about me as a coach to be able to go into to a team and try and make some change um, for the better. And you know, and, and again, that's probably the the main driving force of the reason why. And you know, again, it's it's about the development of the country and you know uh, the actual good things that are going on that you, you can actually enhance and and bring together a group of men to do the best that they possibly can for, for a campaign. So, you know, um, that's what tr sort of drives me. And then obviously, you know, for my role, my previous roles, um, it was about getting those players to the next level. And that was just through, you know, a, a team that does well. So, you know, for, for this role, it's it's a little bit different because it's an international team. And, um, you know, the pinnacle for me is as a, as a coach is to coach internationally. And then obviously for the players, it's, it's exactly the same. So. You know, where to from for them um, as a group, and that's um, you know obviously to do well at Rugby World Cup. You know, after your selection, after when you selected as a head coach of Manusa Moa, you said, "Quoted, I know full well it comes with great responsibility." Would you elaborate on that? Yeah, look, well, you you you're pretty much the head coach of the, of the national team, but it's not just the team. I don't think in Samoa, you know, rugby's 
pretty much everything, um, you know, and with that, mm. that's a huge responsibility. Mm. Um, yeah, and again, to put Samoa back on the map, um, again, uh, and how we do that, how do we approach that, and how, how we go about that, you know, mm. that's, that's a big responsibility as well. And, you know, and then obviously they, they haven't been doing so well in, in the previous years, um, and it's to, you know, to get that passion in the back um, through the through the country um, with performance from our team on field and mm -hmm. you know that's my job at Rugby World Cup is to make sure that we're, we're getting that. Ale whanong rong watu male tuto ala o fiunga valu ale watu la mai watu imutangi olo oyole ole tai tai o tai tai malanga ole au ole manager ole au ole mansa mo ole nifu mai tau nai tau sanga mo vai o watu la mai ole whanong rong watu ita lai le sao no mai o fo le o mai wanga mutangi fo le le tu langa le fil filio ye. Lai sel fa nga tia fo le ona lan sao no nga fa pea ole e fiunga lue i au e mau la 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 tu fa ti nonga underdogs ol ta u e te o wa o fo e o li si fo e te te fa pe na lo to ma fo fo la la sao si si la ya le lu nga le lu e ya ma ni o tu la mai mai october last year i la na ya wa wa i le au ma la nga i lu mai o mai la te mi ne le o tu e ma mau ai fa ti no fa mo e mo e mo le au ol ta tu chu of tai e le tu la nga le le ma ma le ma nga lu e fa ta se ma wa lu nga ma ta ngi ta lu na a ma ta le la na Ona faya onga mol mon samo e sa o leer tulanga le le ilana sa ona a e fi fi e ila wa uya mata uye ma e e le lei ona e fi tu tu na e fu le lei a e ma fai ona ona tu mai lo na nga ngai e le culture ta to e le le flexibility yeah flexibility is flexible i tulanga fu pe pe mana o mia e fa fa ngo fie le nga lwa nga fa ye wa ye fo ye si fa ya nga fo ye o mai ye ile ma fa yo na nga wa i mai na to lo to ine ye ya ta to ta to nga nu fa sa mom to nga fa pe na a ole sa ula nga nga matang e ma fa yo na ona tu wa se tu wa la lo fo le ma fa long long mai ye mai ya ta ngi fo ile to no ta to a le lo na nga nga le le Ile mai ile o tatu loko place i tono le o tatu o tatu au i tamu fai e ati na e o le la e ila o ia mata o ia i e ila nga nga fai ile tamu fai ile nga ta i tamu ta alo i fafu na only the place outside but o tamu ta alo inside sa mo i le tono sa mo a i mu fai o na a fa pe o le ta alo tatu i sa mo i lo te i se nga nga fa pe i fiu a tatu i ta alo i le i se tatu o vanol man sa mo. Is the reality of the fire? I'm not sure. They mean they pay for four years. It was the total time that all the Almanza more the Pacific Nations Cup. You may miss some more. Yeah, yeah. Tula ngalina lo yai. Yo lala wai le 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 va inga voi le. There is the reality of the fire. I'm not sure. More pay for the alu total time more. Yeah. Steve, as a Maori representative, also play for Tasman, Auckland, North Harbour, Southland. Also assistant coach. From a coaching perspective, like counties Manukau, North Harbour, has that really, and also part of Auckland Blues franchise, has that really prepared you to undertake a huge and massive task of bring back some pride into Samoan rugby? As you, you said earlier on that uh, Samoan rugby is very down here before you came to the, on board. Yeah, look, I think um, the teams that I've been involved in definitely. You know, um, especially at, uh, for, for all the three teams that I've uh, coached will be involved in, you know, especially mm -hmm. culturally, you know, they come from all different dynamics, um, whether they're Tongan, Fijian, mm -hmm. uh, Māori, Pākehā, um, you know, and it's been, a, you know, the the big thing is as a coach is how you bring them together in the environment and the culture you create, um, you know, and then all of the other technical, tactical part of the game will come after that. So. You know, uh, you know that's one part of myself as a coach that I believe in that. You know, um, that I I do quite well is being able to have that ability to bring a group of men together, and mm -hmm. and it's about the relationships you build with your players. I mean, you can have the best players in the world, but if they don't want to go out on the field and play for you, then they they won't. So, you know, you've got to develop relationships with people and and make sure you're getting those connections first. You know, and it's not just about rugby. You know, I'm mm -hmm. a type of coach that likes to understand family and their children and where they're from and um, what makes them tick and you know and things like that um, uh, they're really important or just as important as what they do on field because if we get the off-field stuff right mm -hmm. um, then the things on field will take care of itself and look at it, 
things won't change and you know the teams that I've been involved in they, it takes some time um, you know but you know that's the, that's the beauty of the, the game that we we're in you get the opportunity to be able to you know bring my flavor to um, the Samoan coaching coaches role and you know I've got a great uh, management group in behind me which is really really important as well um, you know to be able to to help me and and um, do the things that we we need to do so you know we've got a good strong coaching group and, and Chris Latham and Ben Afiaki and, and mm -hmm. Al Rogers um, and supported well by you know Aloy who's beside me not below me <laughs> as a manager <laughs> um, <laughs> And you know we've we've got various other people within our within our management group that do all sorts of things you know to, to make my job a lot easier and make the players' jobs a lot easier you know there's so much that goes on and behind you know not just a, a campaign but a but a team and it's not just about the coaches you know there's so much work you know without the, these guys beside yeah. me um, um, that I probably wouldn't be able to do my job and you know focus on what I need to do and bring a team together so mm -hmm. yeah great. How much do you know and learn about Samoan rugby flair and physical and confrontational forward play and it's running rugby where it used to be? I, I hope so. Is that something that you are you know, trying to instill and bring it back? Yeah, definitely. I, and I, I think, I suppose, the um, professional game is sort of, I wouldn't say, yeah, it's taken a little bit of that out of... Out of um, out of rugby, the natural flair of um, of uh, players and, and coaches coaching that out of them, and players have been having to stick to structures, and then obviously, um, you know, teams doing analysis on other teams and defensive, t you know, lines and that starting to make things a lot harder um, for for um, for players to sh show their natural flair. But one thing that we've encouraged our players and our team is, yes, we have systems and structures, but if you see something. Um, and you you want to play that, then go for it. You know you've got our full back, and we'd rather your instincts. Eh? Yes, we'd rather our players play to that um, and see the opportunity and, ha and have a crack at it, mm. than not. And then we're asking the question why. So, you know, we, we still, you know, because we've, we've got some exciting players, and again, and that's you know we we select a, a team around our game plan that we want to play. But you know you've got to have. You know, people that can open up a game and can win games for you just based on their natural ability. And I think we've got a, you know, we'll have a group of guys that go to Rugby World Cup that, mm. you know, will that are trusted from us as coaches and our management group that to go out there and, and try things. But you know, as long as they're making yeah. the right decisions or decisions to, you know, um, to give us the opportunity to score points, then you know, mm. hopefully we'll see that. Sama malau tabo inga ma wa ele ese foi le fa fong fong ma malau tabo inga ma ese foi le sa noanga ale fiong ele i fa ya ongo ba luanga ma tangi Steve Jackson ele tu langa ole VI ma ma fa ya ongo ulu ona ele pose li lo fa fong al tantu tu nu ulte lo tei mi ia ona ole o sa ho ali tu langa foi le o tau fa ita tu au ina im fa ya na of yet to the people langi in it was a qualifying uh rounds lena fatino a lewa pale mai falang longo to lal tel no a fongalia uh while wanga matangi esel ta u vole langona ile langona fanga tia uh while lua a falang longo to esel ta u vole no no to langa ilanda ya foi ba ai pe na isa no temu fan Telelon sil fia tulang fo le fit filinga o winga malangon na tamata ano ala ilau sil sila yai o le pulio le au na ito sang o mobile fo ilau tulay mai Steve maluwang alu e tele se se anga ilumol tato au le ni fa mo 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 le anga yatu le World Cup. Aftai o le tulang mo mo ay e fa aftai o na uwa tato o file le pulalang. On ia nai fo ia temali ita so sa mga luwe fata silia na na mayel tato au lo matulang alo ay ne ia lela wo fa wa we evaluang ang matangi ma e fi fi le loto malang ang on na ototono le mansa mo ma na ia yo le le spili pule pule fi fi ang o le auta alo ay na ili ang atle management ia otam ta alo fo ila to ia wo ay la le le tato nunga le yate au on na Oleh telo time ye, ya tato wa yo samo. Ese fo tato tu ma tato, tato wa nga, ma tulang ang fai on na, 
o na ofi ngo ofi i tono lo to manga ngo tam ta alo mm. i lo o la wa u la ia tu o la lo ia vai luanga matangi i te leo tangi ia pe i o tu langa ia i tau rotu ma tu langa vape yeah. na a ia mele tau ta alo a i yeah. te fia fia la o na e, e, na te talia ina, na talia ina. Yeah. Ah. Uh, o faa bai lea, o faa bai a lea ta tu pola la vol tu lang e fia la vol mea fiu yai. O o nai ta mai mea la i tia i o ta tu anu ia wa e fo i si me e fia ringi a. E a e fai so o ia la lea o ngai e fai so o e me. A e fai ngau fia la o nau te tal nau tia vai luanga matangi. Tali e e vai luanga matangi fa tu an. A pa o a me o o tanga ta e fia si lea o la le e sia o la le ia ni fa mu ta ta la i. Dia lawa wa ai ai le i lo tu ma ta to tu la na. Yo wa fie fie la wa mo le wa no fo i le po to po to fa ta si ma le au i le a so mo le a so. Nga e te pe ol ta to wa nga no fa sa mo. Nga i a o fa nga ma le a i nga ai ta lo no ti i le ma ta i wa fa i le a so. Wa tu la nga na i ta to wa so. Nga tu la nga fa pe na pe ol nga nga fie fie na lo i le. Ngon sa ngon te ma ni ma e e e fa nga e ti a i le lo to la o ta to i e e pa ti no to no i le a wa i. Ole mukayon na ista tu tu ala lo Italia man. Ole ta u ala sa mo ala sa no ang a mailuang o matangi mas foy le wa wa sa no le le pule le au ya mailuang. Ole tu lang a foy le le mukayon na ona aman na iya le faya ang a Steve iya si Fautuang a ina iya mukayon na o nga sa kasitasi ma fao fao o tatu tam o alam mo fao na utam fao na u samo malana sila sila may olfaya onga ilay o sa samo ale wa wa fio atu feso so ani mga luy may lato nei fao wab tatu tal no nga pa may alam lang bubu when we come back we will be talking more about manu samo rugby and its preparations for the upcoming World Cup in Japan in four weeks time. Te fa tal fa tu sa mo ilam tampo inga o le mato talanonga o le fiunga ya vailuango matangi Steve Jackson o le faya onga ulu o le manu sa mo ya ite na nifu le fiunga ya vailua loyal sana ya o le li puleng o le o le puleng ale o le o le au le manu sa mo ya awa fu ilang ya tu o le manu sa mo ile ipul lalangi ilmasin. So welcome back. This show was made possible by Foundation North, Vuxit and Porridge Civil Engineering, The Voyage Media Limited, and Face TV. Continuing our discussion with Manu Samo head coach, Wailuang Omatangi, Steve Jackson, and team manager, Wailua Aloi Alessana. Uh, Steve, our Pacific neighbors, Fiji and Tonga World Rugby rankings are 10 and 15, respectively. Also, Georgia, Italy, and USA in 12, 13, and 14. Manu Samo at 16. What is your code for Manu Samo ranking after the upcoming World Cup? Well, I think um, you know, we understand we're in that position at the moment. And I suppose you know what we do at Rugby World Cup. You know, we'll take care of the rankings. We're not actually look thinking about the the rankings as as such. Um, it's about our performance at Rugby World Cup, and you know, you win games there, then you know, hopefully your rankings get a bit higher. But mm. I think you know the, the first and foremost thing that we need to do is perform at Rugby World Cup, regardless of rankings. You know, we've just got to make sure that you know we we're, we're up there with the world's best, um, and we're performing well against the world's best and and winning games, so you know that'll be our main focus moving into Rugby World Cup, you know, and then obviously later on they'll have rankings. But you know, again, you do well at the Rugby World Cup, and we want to automatically qualify for 2023. Mm -hmm. and we don't want to go through a repercharge um, like they have done. Um, mm -hmm. So again, that's you know we, we're going out, we're going there to win. Okay, you know, look at the selection of uh, the makeup of the team, which we haven't have your final squad. Uh, uh, probably very soon after this uh, Pacifica Challenge, I uh, look at the team you picked uh, mostly from Europe, like the the home unions and uh, and Japan. You know how is it fair to say that uh, trying to mould and put together all these players in a very short period of time will, can be a, a, a very huge task for for you and the management in terms of making these players stick for to to play well and to perform at the highest level. Yeah, look, it, it, it is difficult because they've come from all different um, 
backgrounds in terms of their rugby um, and then obviously they've had different coaches and different styles of the way the teams want to play and then you know for us it's about having conversations with guys that we know that can drive uh, an environment and the way that we want to play the game and and then also trying to make the team you know trust in what where we're heading and what we want to do and, and our vision and that for for our for our team and you know, and then they've just got to trust in the systems and that, that we put in place and get them to have buy-in as soon as we possibly can. Um, you know, and then it's obviously what what is our goal after that and how do we get to that that point. So, it, you know, to answer your question, it is it is quite difficult. But I think the the beauty about a rugby world cup year and as we have at the moment, we've been able to get our players a lot earlier than we normally do. Um, normally, it's a week out from a test match and you play sort of two or three test matches a year and then that's it. Um, so this time we've been able to bring them in a week, two weeks prior to our first game against Tonga and Samoa and then through the PNC and then we've had a couple of other games over there in Fiji uh, which one gives us the ability to put in our game plan and get to know the players you know, one up individually and, and what makes them tick and then you know, we'll name a World Cup squad shortly um, and those players in that PNC an opportunity to put their hands up and, and then um, you know um, we'll be in camp for probably about eight weeks all up for most players before we get to Japan, which is, you know, extremely beneficial for us. Um, we've got two games, one next week against the New Zealand Divisional 15 um, at Eden Park, and then our last game against the Australia in, um, in, in uh, Parramatta, the new Parramatta Stadium, which will, you know, will be a benchmark for us for to sort of see where we're at moving into, into, into the World Cup, yeah. Mm. Yalum Fanau, or for Amatuola to Concarate to no Mao, Eulopa Falani, my apani, or Walato Lepo Polifo, Yalato to Pemoa, Matutongi, our Mafayona man away my Olalita, all to Langale, and I Yalum Fanau, Tama Fanau, a Miss Foylana, I want to wing about Tito Lua, Yavanel Fafongale to no Molato, Matu, a Lango Lango Molato, on all of you my. A represent but a alo mo sa mo ala ufiong ali tay tay malang. Ole tulang ali fa nga iti ay lava le loto mo le nganga eh tati fa ay alufa ay yalom fa nau ni yal tato tunu ah ilinga tala ay ilato ah nai matu ay lufa pia on ah tuwina le nganga le sa mo ito no o tato tamta alo yasi i o may eh tau tual tato yawa ili ili pose lilo. Ilita ita ifa tu solia tu peye mau ilita tu au imeo lo ikon kalatelo ta aloi mai peita e fanga itia le nganga ma 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 fie fie ma tu eva ita tu au ilanga ta ilor ta tu tu mu mana uwa fa matu esia tu langa le ai o mai ita alu mula tu mansa mo o o ifo ila o na e au mai ita tu tam ta aloi ya mai fafo Ila vano e mafai on lifi e ilunga i le tato i le tato tulang a le tulang ta alo le ngata i le e fa o Sofia i fo i na isi o so ta alo e o mai e tau tual tato o tunu e ala le mansa mo a le o le tulang a le i e wa o pe o le tulang a le le manager e pati no a ya u e tulang a i le i le vai ngo hotel so malanga ma ma tu e le ngata la i na a le vai ala o le o le tulang a fo i le i le ile tu fa ta singo loto manga fa sa mo a itun ra to po ofe ol mela te mata wina po ofe ala vale tu no esa wole ta to tam ta lo po engilani po falani po fe etu tu sa yo le etu tu sa la to loto fa ta si pe mai ola to sa mo a e mo fu se vano ete ete fi o to ete va va itu no le ta to to ngalo pinga e se le ma na ya Oi nai lo e foi la le 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 o matua i a ma le ma le tui no le le ta i a la i a lom fa na o ta to tu no o lo ta lo kapi. Okay, Steve. What what is like sitting there during the fundraising in Samoa to raise funds for for to send its rugby team to the World Cup since 1991. This is the time of the year that Samoan people all around the world back home in Samoa 197,000 people and another half a million people who live abroad. What does it? What comes through your mind uh, when you sit there looking at a, a ten-year-old primary school kid, a Reverend Minister, and an elderly, eighty-year-old elder person come in to pledge their two dollars or two tala? Yeah, look, you talk about responsibility before it just makes. <laughs> <laughs> I 
makes it a little bit more harder, you know, mm -hmm. um, moving into a Rugby World Cup to, to make sure this team performs. Okay. I mean, look, I am absolutely amazed the amount of work that um, that goes in behind the scenes to be able to get this team to a Rugby World Cup. And we're so appreciative and, and um, mm -hmm. thankful for all the, all the work and the money that's been put forward. You know, we understand families are giving up, you know, um, a lunch or a dinner to be able to donate to our cause. And, and that's what I mean about, you know, rugby is the mm. pinnacle of, of Samoa. And, um, you know, there's, well, it's a, it's, a, it's a massive job for our players just to go over there and say, and, and, and you know, for us, just to say thank you, really, mm. and say thank you by, by performance um, that those people that have donated um, can be proud that their money's gone to good use and that um, you know our players have been given every opportunity to perform the, to the best of their ability and look at uh, you know sometimes it brings a tear to your eye but a yeah. tear of happiness just to show how you know passionate and like you said in 91 I think it was a wheelbarrow that they took around the streets mm -hmm. and yeah, they do some fantastic things on the island to um, to make sure that we raise the money to be able to to get on an airplane. Yeah, I mean we we are running out of time, and you know, is is it uh, is it fair to say that uh, a winning Manu Samoa World Cup campaign answers probably tick tick all the boxes, including what the Honourable Prime Minister Tula Eba, the chairman of Rugby Samoa and Rugby, you know, fighting for Samoa to be have a seat on the IRB, and also sort of fighting with to make sure Tonga, Fiji and Samoa and other island being recognised, that sort of thing? Oh, exactly. You know, mm -hmm. we want to unite and inspire our nation and the only way we can do that is, is through winning. Mm -hmm. um, mm -hmm. And again, you know, like I said before, you know, we're not going over to the Rugby World Cup to compete. Um, you know, and it's about winning and it's my job mm -hmm. as a head coach to make sure that, um, you know, we're in the right shape and the right condition and the right frame of mind to go out there and and perform to our best mm. as, as we possibly can and, and if they can do that then hopefully the, the winning side of things will take care of itself but you know winning builds everything you know it builds yeah. you know confidence in the community and um, and then you know obviously you know, our players do well then you know opportunities abroad um, mm. also in terms of financial benefits and that will, will, will come to them as well and you know so again you know um, we're not going over to compete and we've made that absolutely clear to this group that um, you know Winning needs to be part of our DNA. Mm -hmm. Your final word for Samoan audience who are watching this. Yeah, look, I just um, to the Samoan community, you know, thank you very much for everything that you do. Um, thanks for being behind this team, and um, from myself and the management group, these guys are working as hard as they possibly can mm -hmm. um, to do the very, very best at uh, Rugby World Cup, and um, we'll leave no stone unturned um, to make sure that we go there to get a, to get W's. Thank you. Los fuse con muy muy. Ya sao sao no ngafa i u ba lu a wa fo ile ta bo inga ta tu tu. Afta i tele mo la no o ma sia si ma yai fa afta i sa mo la u lang lang o ya tu ma ya lo fa tu tu anga le a ol man sa mo si fa i le ta tu ta lo ngali polo lang ya te ta lo mai pia ina ya man wi ta tu au ya lo fa tu si ta tu tu no fa afta i tele. Tai fa afta fa afta i tele la ya. Wai luang o matangi, Steve Jackson, le fai aonga ulu ul man samo, ya mis fo ya le fiong e li i tai tai au. Many thanks for watching. You can catch us next week at the same time or see the program on Face TV, on demand, YouTube or on the Voyage Media website. Until next time, to a fast way forward.